this is our Richmond shop and hub, so it's all combined into one. So this is the Sister Works shop, and as you can see, it's filled with products. On this centre table, we have our Sister Works label products. They're sustainable and natural products as well. So we have organic soy candles, for instance, a whole range of reusable products, such as sandwich wraps, foldable lunch bags, so all environmentally friendly. A whole lot of accessories, like jewellery, there's toys down here as well. We are at the new Sit Sister Works Empowerment Hub at Richmond, which is the new site, and it's really exciting. We have a lot of women in the room, probably what around 25 to 30 women out there, just really celebrating the fact that they have just received funding to have this bigger site that will mean that they will provide more services, be able to support more women. So it's all exciting right now. From now, this place is called Sister Works Empowerment Hub. Empowerment Hub. Yes? Hub means home, shelter, a place where we all are learning how to work and have friends and community in Australia. Behind the shop we have uh, office space for our sales team. This is our social enterprise production space. So you're involved in the social enterprise production. So today we have some sewing going on. Okay, so there's bread bags being made today. Yes, we have some office and training spaces. So so at the moment we have an advanced sewing class happening. So this is with some of our senior sisters. You are okay then? Yeah. Two more yeah. minutes. Her name is Zari. Zari? Yeah. Yeah. She's from Iran. Okay, beautiful. And uh, she has family here. And uh, she has uh, experience in sewing. She has diploma. We do it here in Richmond uh, with all the trainings that we have, craft, English, everything. And you do the same process in uh, our food handling certificate program. This is our uh, program control process. And then we also have the update sisters process and the sister information progress management. This morning, Sister Works Mobile Hub is at the Belgium Avenue neighborhood house, and this is the room that craft session is happening. We have a group of women who came for well, several times. This is the third time for us to do this session. Hi, ladies. This afternoon, Sister Works is at in Broad Meadows at Saint Dominic's Community Learning Centre. We're doing Mobile Hub in partnership with Migrant Resource Centre and um, there's a group of Arabic speaking ladies who are doing uh, learning this craft activities. And this is the Yo Bendigo Youth Facility where our hub is, so come on in. So we're inside the hub now. This is our little room, or this is our pop-up shop where we sell all sorts of goodies and take this stock to markets around locally as well. And here is our space where we do our sewing production and trainings. Today we are running an information session. So we will have Carolyn from the CFA and Mapo from Bendigo Community Health Services helping us out. And lastly, we have our new sister, Aloel, and lovely volunteer, Grace, who are doing a one-to-one -one, uh, IT mentoring session. Do you want to say a few words about what you do at Sister Works? Um, <laughs> at the moment, I'm just uh, finishing off um, some performance um, review, so we do a uh, uh, twice a year performance review and we're actually in the cycle of, uh, of doing that. I'm a project coordinator 
-hmm. at Sisterhood. Mm -hmm. Great, just what a day go. So, what does that involve? Um, mainly involves um, all the courses we do, coordinating with all our sisters mm -hmm. and the managerial, mm -hmm. and registering the sisters. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 great. So you're part of the engagement team and getting the sisters to come in for the classes during the week. Teacher Melissa is teaching how to do upcycling of jeans. Here you get to learn how to upcycle and reuse materials to a beautiful product. No, can you please tell us what you're making? Yes, red bricks, red bags. And what other workshops are you involved in at Sister Works? Lunch bread, shopping bread, produce bread. Mm -hmm. Okay, so a lot of the Sister Works label products. And how long have you been with Sister Works? One year. One year. Okay, so at the start of 2020. So you were involved with face masks. Yes, sewing as well. Yes. Oh, very important thing very for me. Very important project. Yeah, absolutely. Do you like it? Yes, it looks amazing. Me, definitely, my favorite is this one. Oh, really? Nice. I think it's very for summer. It's very oh, cute, it's and nice. it's the first time you are making like type of different uh, pattern inside like this. Yes. Is it I hard? This will be very popular in the shop. Okay. Yes. I will make. Is it hard <laughs> to do or not much? No. These will be good as well for people who like the smaller earrings. Yeah. Because so. you are making stud as well, but you are making this type mm -hmm. of shape of colors. I have one of these. But now you are more... Colorful? Yes. Okay. Oh, it's what I really love in your collection. Yes. You can just play with all the different colors. Yes. And... Absolutely. <laughs> for... Yes, good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you checking? Okay, great. <laughs> You've come off the Velcro a little bit, but that's okay. All we do is, if we hold down this, do this with your left hand, and then we can do this with, with your right hand. Pull this, again, always this one goes forward. Yeah, mouse. Well done, perfect, mouse. Uh, so we have the mouse, what is this called? Uh, the keyboard. Ah, keyboard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So mouse, keyboard, and push this one. Uh, this, yeah. Uh, French. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we say it in French. Great. Uh, well done, screen. Screen. Yeah. Do you wanna? You want me to write it down so you, it's easier to remember? Um, yeah. So we will just open up the app mm -hmm. and pretty much just browse, look mm -hmm. around the yeah. app. Uh, watch your videos, watch a few videos, and see if you can navigate. It's alright when you're learning. Yeah. Okay, so first of all, is make sure you go into the next little um, video there. Okay? So I'm just gonna um, sort of show you a stitch in your position here. So, first thing, I just wanna make sure you remember, first thing is you're just gonna pull the wool through that first. There, so you end up with two on the board, yeah? Shape of something you want to make many times. The measuring tape. Oh, oh, oh. oh, you make me hungry and you're ready. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got 36, I've got about three serves there. It just made 36 pancakes just like that. So. Because of Sister Works, now I am calling myself as an entrepreneur, which my parents are very happy to hear. <laughs> they support me, but in terms of like uh, moving forward, like uh, how to market your products in uh, Instagram or um, how to like uh, talk with the customers, because you know that I have been. Uh, 
coming to sister works and uh, being at the shop it gave me a good opportunity to like adapt myself to uh, the culture today has been really exciting it's the end of our pre-employment work ready aged care workshops so we've held workshops with 13 women over eight weeks to prepare them for working in aged care in Australia. I like to community work, women's and group work. I like to, I join the sister work. Sister work, but uh, more help. First time I take um, food candling certificate. This is the second one. I am very happy for you, this one. Things but money, earn money, this is good. <laughs> I feel this is an opportunity and then um, to join the course and uh, my ambition is to be a policewoman. My second choice is to be a nurse. So I thought uh, HK course will be a good opportunity for me to continue my nursing. I think education is the main, first main thing in our life. Without education, I think we can't go through like uh, we can't move forward. So education is the main key for our success. Women are the backbone, women of any society. Women, if the woman falls over, the family falls over, the community falls over, uh, women are the nurturers, but we're not to be seen just as the mothers. <laughs> we are people who have incredible resilience, incredible insight, and that is undervalued in our society. Um, so women have an, a really important role to create a much more balanced and um, uh, nurturing environment within society and communities.